Hey y'all, Mythic Rare here, and the entire month of May, I just went ham because May is my birthday month, and I basically wanted to buy all the things that I ever hearted on Etsy throughout the month, and I kind of sort of did. So, while I cleverly hide my address, I'm going to say what shop they came from. <laughs> so without further ado, let's open up the international one first. It deserves it because it came from the farthest away. This is from the crafting cat and it should be putty. Oh, packing slip gonna get that out of camera. Yes. Okay, so that is that. Um, I do want to take a look at what just fell on the floor a second. Oh, okay. Well, this is going to look prettier. Thank you for supporting my small business, Crafting Cat UK. And then here's the socials. So what did we order? Daydreams and ice cream. Oh, it glitters. It smells very perfumey. This one is Spring Bouquet. Oh, cool. That is cool. All the neon colors. This one's a very floral scent as well. I guess if you like your scents more intense, then you'll probably like this shop. Ooh, I believe in magic. Whoa, sparkles. Ooh. Now see, this was the scent that I would have thought that daydreams and ice cream would have smelled like. This one smells like very much, ooh. I wanna say like if you've ever Hmm. I can't really place it. It's almost like if you um 
have like a like it's a berry and vanilla sort of scent. That's what comes to mind. Like if you take the the vanilla buttercream scent from Bath and Body Works and then you like mix it with like a blueberry or a raspberry that would be that would be that putty scent <laughs> and then last but not least unicorn dust oh purple of course and sparkly too Oh, y'all, this one smells like just pure lavender bounce sheet goodness. So that was it from the Crafting Cat UK. Definitely loads of putty. Loads of interesting putty. Before we go, oh, this wasn't actually my packing slip. It was um, things from the shop owner. So thank you. I am so excited about every order I receive because a lot of planning, effort, and testing has gone into every single item I sell. So thank you for making my day. Um, oh, so she has a Facebook group where Kat uses the group to talk about upcoming products and announce new releases and then that's where customers can go um to see the new things and then do giveaway things important if you have bought any of my putties please note these are not for eating however delicious they may smell Oh my goodness, yeah, that, that is true. It smells good enough to eat, but please don't. <laughs> so in case you've never used putty before, load your pen by sticking the empty single placer or multi-placer into the putty, wiggling it, the, then pull the remaining putty brick away from the pen, clean away any excess putty from around the edges with your fingernail or some tweezers, the putty should be level at the top of the placer. If it doesn't come to the top, load some more in and clear any access and then start diamond painting after a few presses. You may find you may need to clear away a little more excess putty and if it gets, as it gets displaced by diamonds, you can even use the putty on special drills like ABs, but best to press lightly. Oh no, number seven, if you are a hard placer and you find that the putty becomes compressed in your placers quickly, try topping up rather than replacing it completely, then you'll find it lasts much longer as the putty will remain near the top of the placers. Ooh. I recommend storing your putty in a Ziploc bag at room temperature. In extremely hot temperatures, if the putty is not performing well, you may need to chill it in the fridge. Ooh. Okay, we are definitely keeping that insert. I love it when shop owners give us the little ins and outs for all of those things. Like, good job, cat. Good job. Butterfly effect wears and more putty. I intend.
intentionally did this because I have been in the habit of working on big, huge kits like these last couple ones and I am using my thin multi-placers from Diamond Art Club a lot more and is it just me or does anybody else like besides me besides like diamonds and washi does anybody else besides the two of us like find that their putty just wears out in their diamond art club placers like go ahead and let me know in the comments oh that I almost doxed myself. That was my invoice. Um, ooh, okay. So a note from the shop. Thank you for your support of our small business. Join us in our Facebook group. Or join us over on Patreon for the monthly giveaways and behind the scenes. And then because they had um, things to commemorate the month of May, I got the emerald and I believe I got the diamond putty. Oh, there's another thing in here. Hang on. dot dot putty but let's read this one first hello and welcome to butterfly effect wears we are a husband and wife team that work together to create beautiful and high quality wares we are proud to be a veteran owned and family ran small business Butterfly effect is defined as a small change that goes on to create bigger ripple in, out in the world. To us, it is a reminder that everyone can make a difference. Each and every purchase we receive, package, and send to you, our customer, has more of an impact than a simple transaction. Thank you for choosing to shop with us. Aww. All right, so then you're going to get the instructions for Dot Dot Putty as well, if you ever order from them. And it kind of says the same thing that Crafting with Cat says, like you want to be, you want to make sure that you scrape away any excess and then, you know, make sure that you keep it, um, kind of sort of treat your putty like you would your medication. Make sure it's not too hot, not too cold, just right, which is room temperature. I hate to mess up the butterfly, but I'm going to have to. Okay, cool. More stickers. That's cute. Diamond dot dot putty. And emerald dot dot putty. Emeralds are over stone, so I had to pick that up. And I'm just like, well, I may as well get the diamond too. So here is their business card along with their socials. And that is cool. So, Emerald, what do you look like? Okay, yes, definitely looks exactly like the product shots. Oh. Ooh. It smells like a combination of fresh-cut spring grass 
and the Irish Spring soap. Like, you sniff it, and if green had a scent, this would be that scent. Yeah, just like a hint of spearmint in there too. Interesting. Diamond dot dot putty. Hmm. I wonder what a diamond smells like. Not not that I'd want to try. <laughs> I wonder if it's gonna smell like the black ice car tree freshener. That would just be, that would be interesting. So this is what that looks like. Yeah, I kind of expected this one to be like gray and white. Oh my God. <laughs> I called it. It smells like the black diamond car tree air freshener. Yeah, it smells, it smells pretty much like black ice. All right, so one last time, Butterfly Effect wears. And we interrupt the wax to bring you a thing from Print Au Sable 3D. No, this whole entire haul is not just like wax. There's gonna be other diamond painting tools and accessories in here too. Oh, okay. I see a packing slip. We are just gonna remove that. Okay, so they gave me a thank you 15 so that if you like what they have and you wanted another thing from them, you can be a repeat offender. Oh, so it was bubble mailed and it was wrapped in paper. Okay. Well, hey, I mean, that's cool. You're recycling. And this was the rainbow mat tray that I have been having my eye on. Oh, that lid is cool. Okay, there has to be some sort of trick to getting it open. Oh, okay, so this is actually the lid. And it comes out like that. Okay, cool. I love how that slides. And then this piece that I took out a second ago, You feed it in, like, right here. So then... Oh, hang on. I think this is supposed to go the other way. Yeah, there we go. So this piece, you pull on it, and then your diamonds are going to come out of this little hole right here. 
So it's, yeah, like, it's got a built-in spout, essentially. And then you'll just, like, slide this. And see? It'll close. That is neat. I'll have to try this. And if I like it, then... I'll definitely pick up the bigger size of it, but I just wanted, I just wanted the mini one in order to try it out. I definitely love the filament and everything. I think, like, their logo, that is really cool. How it's, like, the two-toned colors and stuff and, like, the rainbow pastel. I just, I love it. I cannot, actually, you know what? Hang on. I have some diamonds, like, over yonder that I can just, um, grab really quick, and then we can, like, see how this shakes out. Oh, they actually line up pretty nicely. And then see, like, if I wanted to pour these back into the bottle, just have it like this. And then we're just going to take this thing and we're going to pull it. I was not quite over top of the of the thing because I'm, you know, having to look through my camera, make sure that I'm in the shot. But yeah, that was that's actually a really cute little tray. I have another tray coming up later so I'm just gonna keep that jar of diamonds like right there and then once again print out supply So this was the thing that took a minute, but it was well worth it because this is a custom pen. This is from O'Brien Custom Turning. And I believe I got like the double bow tie was swooped ends, I think, is what it was called in the listing. If not, then I'll, um, I'll take a moment right here to, like, correct myself, um, the name and, like, what the name of the actual, uh, turnstile was. Oh. My goodness. Tape. Paper. Uh, 
So here is my actual pen. Oh, a pen pen. Orion Custom Turning from Etsy, Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Oh, and this is a stylus. Neat. This is very nice. Thank you. Your order made our day. We hope we make yours. If we, if you have any questions about your order, contact us anytime. We would love to hear from you. And then there's our business card. Handmade diamond painting pens and more. Oh, so they do like actual resin pens and stuff too. Oh, that is very cool. Wait, is this like a lip balm? Yeah, it is. It's a lip balm. Oh, yeah, it's just like kind of your basic uh, Carmex lip balm. But hey, that's cool. And the moment we've all been waiting for. I never have enough straightening wedges, so I asked for one to come as one of my ends on my pen. Wow, this is a tight fit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now you understand why I ordered the rainbow tray now, because I had to have it to go with the pastel rainbow pen. Oh my god. I love it. It is so beautiful. Oh my god. And I have been just like, like, really going after the thicker pens lately. So it's nice just to have something like more on the thin side. Like, I love it. This is so beautiful. Oh my god. Whoa, actually, you can kind of see, like, the lines and stuff where they um, have the tool, like, with the lathe and where they, like, spun it, too. That's actually really interesting because a lot of my pens, yes, like, they're polished and they're finished smooth, but this one, like, you can actually kind of tell where it was where it was worked and stuff on the lathe. That is actually really interesting. Like that was an incredibly cool pen. Oh my goodness. Thank you, O'Brien Custom Turning. So, I'm sure by now we all know that there is a saying in um, the diamond painting community when it comes to Donna Bass and the RNG and Facebook. If you don't succeed, come back next week and try again. <laughs> I had been trying for like a month to get a pink pen to go with Usagi City that I was going to be working on. And then I swear this pen must have been poured on like May 4th because the name of it was May the Pink Be With You. <laughs> <laughs> and 
Like, I'm just like, yeah, I bet she poured it on the fourth or something. And then um, there was this other one called Spark Intensity, and it was purple. It was glittery. Absolutely loved it. Put, you know, put myself in for the RNG. Did not get it the first time around. Something fell through with the previous person. So they sometimes, you know, when that happens, they can, and you like were in the, in the going for the RNG, you may get offered a pen like later on. And that is what happened. And that is why I have two of Donna Bass. So this one was the original one. Like I can tell just by the ship date, May 22nd. And then it was like as soon as the first one got here is when I found out about the other pen. And I'm just like, I'm done. Take my money. I'm done. It has been a minute since I've ordered from her, so I think I have to start these. Over here. Peanuts and they're colorful. Don't worry, be happy. So there's my five placer and my single placer and Oh, there is a charm that comes with this one. Oh, how neat. It looks like it's a fox. And then there's her business card. We don't follow trends, we create them. Oh my goodness. I am not sure how, but I will. Oh man. Like, sometimes when people just put their stickers and things in here, it's like they just know exactly what you needed to hear, and I needed to hear that. Oh, okay. So that thing inside the box, that was my, that was my invoice. I don't think y'all could have seen that anyways because the peanuts were hiding it. And you can't buy happiness, but this gets pretty close. Yeah, it sure does. Oh, I see it. I can probably just slide it out. Yep, there it is. May the pink be with you. <laughs> Yep, that'll definitely fit with Usagi City, and I love that, like, that design, that is so cool. And I haven't, I don't think that I have one that's, like, a solid matte color besides my black and white one. So, yeah, this is interesting. 
It reminds me of like strawberry milk or like, yeah, actually strawberry milk. That's, that's a good way to describe it. But this is so pretty. Okay, time for pen number two. Well, that is getting blurred out. <laughs> so then there's my ton placer and I got it with like a super big thing because I knew like I got a really small placer and I love how she's included charms with some of these, like that is cool. Oh, plants. Neat. Oh, I love this kind of paper. That's cool. That's like really good packing material. That is cool. That is cool. Oh my God. That is so cool. Oh my God. The pictures did not do it justice. I feel like I'm basically holding a nebula in my hand. Like this thing. Oh my goodness. Like, that is crazy. The amount of sparkle. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I mean, I could stare at this for freaking for hours. Donna Bass, like, this, this lady, she creates genuine works of art with like every pen. So yes, last but not least, Pure Blix Wax Co. Like, I saw that there were still copies or like things for the May box still available. When I went to go back and look, I didn't see anything for June at all. But I saw that there were still May boxes available. And when I saw what was in the May box, I was like, shut up. Like, shut the front door. Like, hurry up and take my money. We are getting this. Oh, there's an invoice. Well, 
limited edition diamond painters box of the month mermaid dreams pure bliss anniversary special diamond painting and yes we got the added on scent oh and then she gave me five percent off my next order with appreciate you neat washi tape of course twisted mermaid Diamond Daughter Sticky Wax. Mermaid Dreams. This is definitely floral. And then this one makes me think of the it makes me think of the um oh gosh what is the it makes me think of like the sasquatch soap where it's the bay rum <laughs> Ever. that's what twisted mermaid made me think of it just like straight up made me think of rum and then here are these two as putties So we've got Mermaid Dreams and we've got Twisted Mermaid. Um, I want to say that Mermaid Dreams almost smells like the amber scent from Victoria's Secret. And then, yeah, like, Twisted Mermaid just smells like straight up, it just, sm it smells like rum. <laughs> it, it basically smells like, it smells like Malibu inside of a coconut. Like, that's, <laughs> that's straight up, like, the only thing that I can think of with that one. It smells, the Mermaid Dream smells floral, but now that I kind of like smell it again, it actually smells like Axe. Like, I don't know if I just like need to go like poke my nose in some Folgers, but um, it's straight up, at first it smelled like florals, but now it just straight up smells like Axe to me, which I mean that... That isn't such a bad smell, but it's kind of like, hmm, yeah, it smells like Axe. Um, ooh, 602 Cranberry Medium. Love the ABs. Oh, cute little mermaid sticker. Oh, and then we have a mermaid cover minder. Oh, that is cute. Oh, 
Oh, yes. Creations by L.E.P. I have her pink tray. So this just must be the exclusive color for the mermaid box. You know what, actually, I think you'll be able to, I think that you'll be able to see those turquoise drills in this one. So in case in my last, like, small shop haul, you were curious to see how did this one shake out? Like, this is actually um, somewhat decent. Yep, same exact size as my pink one. Yeah, very, very good lineup on the drills. Oh, you know what? Now might be a good time to bust out the attachment. Because if you go back to LEP Shop, you could get this. I got this in my previous small shop haul. And so you'll just slide this on where the cover usually goes. And then you're just going to tip this upside down into your container. And then you'll just like shake it, you know, whatever you need to do in order to get your drills out. Last but not least, we got another pen. Oh, and it has placers. Neat. So these are fat, the fat placers. It looks like a three, a five, and maybe like a nine placer in addition to the single placer. And that's kind of a neat pen. I definitely love the pink and the, the pinky purple and the turquoise in it. It definitely goes with everything else in the box. Like, this is awesome. I feel like I have just opened a whole bunch of birthday presents that have just, like, uh, I love it. I love everything in the box. <laughs> the, the Mermaid Dreams I'm going to have to use sparingly because that is strong. Like, that is way strong. But, um, I loved everything. Oh, my goodness. All right. Well, that is it for me, y'all. I am going to have to spend the next good bit just uh, rounding everything up, cleaning everything up and organizing it all. So I will leave it here. See you at another one. Bye for now.